Was that you want me to casually beat all of Ninpeg in one try? Sure, buddy, I'll do it just for you. I have no idea. What is it about Ninpeg that clicked so hard with me? I cannot tell you. It's just a game that even after I beat, I'm like, I want to go back in there and do it again. <laughs> See if I can get a higher score. And believe me, the high score is not just bragging rights. It is an integral part of actually beating the game because the one-ups that you get, they're tied to your score. They are thresholds of, pun uh, of scoring that oh, oh, oh. thresholds of scoring that will spawn balloons for you to get an extra life. I think it's every 4,000. I haven't actually paid attention because I am too busy trying to stay alive at all times. Just won't do one of these. So uh, don't quote me on that. That is 4,000, but it's close to the 4,000 mark. Every 4,000 points, you get uh, a balloon spawning. So that's why I'm going out of my way to get all this garbage destroyed. I'm telling you, man, I've been coming back to it even after I beat it. Why are you doing? You don't just pick those up, you absolute mo moron. <laughs> you are supposed to shoot them. Okay, I'm a little too close to the edge here. I just got myself killed by a flying pig slash cow. I have yet to decide whether they're pigs or cows. They have no others that I can see. But still, that was 500. But still, their faces look more cow like than pig like to me. I don't know, man. It's hard to decide what kind of creatures I am slaughtering here. Seems schizophrenic either way that somebody would attach a propeller to the back of a cow or a pig and have them fly. But you know, it is a much more common saying to say that uh, pigs are flying and cows are flying. I am wasting so many points here because I chose the wrong path and I've kind of had to commit to it. Otherwise, I'll just freaking die. So that's what's going on there. That was very, very bad. And I feel ashamed. Careful, careful. Hola! <laughs> that's uh, very upsetting. Okay, there's always a tricky spot. All right, we ignore the enemies. We want the cherries. Ooh. So like I said, score is very important for survival. And taking out all the cherries. Yeah, that was not 4,000. So, I don't know. Uh, and the bouncing helmets are very, very important too. They are equally important. They're not onigiris. They're not rice balls wrapped in seaweed. Absolutely not. Ooh, ooh. Okay, let me just murder you real quick. Their helmets, animated, delicious in dungeon style. They have creatures inside them. And then you eat them as you pick them up. It's just as uh, simple as that. Yeah, I really don't like the situation I put myself in. Don't ask me what spawns this sandwich. I really don't know. I hate this. I hate where I'm at. <laughs> Please free me from this torment. What are we but slaves to it? Oh, jeez. All right, I really should have picked up that those uh, payoffs. But oh, maybe this one can become a crown if you let the mu bouncing mushrooms bound bounce long enough. You get one of these. Oh, and it's a nice pile of score. Like it basically counts as murdering. Four, five of those mushrooms, I guess four, because killing one of them would have yielded a hundred, you know. So anyway, th that's this, this is uh, my main game in UFO 50. Isn't that crazy or what? <laughs> uh, I thought that Bug Hunt would be it, but no, it is Nimpec. Nimpec is my jam. Uh, so I'm looking forward to maybe there will be games that have the same vibe. Maybe not the same... Uh, side-scrolling, constant automatic side-scrolling. We could use uh, a different dynamic, although maybe not. Maybe it's the, the automatic side-scrolling that really got me so into it. Because you cannot speed run this game. It is impossible to speed run this game. You play it, 
and it will always last the exact same length with the exception of the final boss which you can kill a little bit faster, a little bit slower mostly depending on RNG the way that uh, the boss spawns uh, the, all the poison bubbles oh no! <laughs> but I had enough room oh! humiliating humiliating absolutely worst time to get that happening too because I uh, don't have enough projectiles to destroy this dang old spiky balls so let's see if we can kill some extra pigs these guys are definitely pigs right uh, I have no doubt about these being pigs instead of cows it's the ones that are on the propellers that weird me out please give me the upgrade thank you thank you appreciate it we got another pile of cherries we don't care about the poison bubbles we, we uh, reject the existence of poison bubbles they are not a problem Terrible uh, jump down, but it's all good. Everything's fine. Oh yeah, give me the, uh, some more balloons, baby. Here is the number of things that you grab because the point threshold is, was definitely not any kind of milestone. It was like seventeen thousand uh, seven hundred something like that. Uh, that will be a weird arbitrary milestone to set for. Hey, here's where we spawn a balloon. It will be freaking bizarre. So maybe it's all a matter of. How many you pick up? Oh, I thought that I would land on the platform. Give me the money. Humiliating. Humiliating. Careful about the rays. Oh! oh! I'm so mad. I'm so mad right now. Why did it... <sighs> this area is actually something I look forward to. Believe it or not because I'm like, I have kind of cracked the code off it. You wouldn't tell because of the way that it's going right now. But this area is like almost trivial to me these days, but I'm getting super idiotically flustered by just having any sort of stake attached to it. It's all right though, we're going to make it happen. It's fine, we're going to uh, bring it back. I see ya, I see ya. I'm getting way too deep into the pig land here. These damn futuristic pig robots need to be eliminated. Alright. <sighs> I'm so salty right now. <laughs> I, I swear I've done much better. But the goal is to finish, not have flawless gameplay. The goal is to get to the end, and I think we can still salvage it pretty handily. Uh, it is e easy to get absolutely destroyed in the second loop. When you beat it for the one time, you do a second loop, and it's a lot harder, but also they give you a ton of lives to go along with it. So hopefully we can make it work, because it will be terrible to get almost to the end of the second loop. And then I humiliate myself. Yep, blah. Humiliate myself in this attempt at just doing it in one go. Please do not eliminate me. All right. Octopus, hungry octopus has been murdered. My sandwich comes back to my hands. Let's take it back to my partner. We are gay together and we're going to be sharing this with sloppy kisses and now we go back we go back into ninpick plus immediately uh, get murdered by the cheesiest most awful of all enemies twice because i'm dumb and uh, i have no concept of what survival is like in this game even though i've beaten like four times by now <laughs> it's just uh by far, my most hated enemy in the entire game are those guys that spawn. Oh, wow, wow, the bouncing bullets here almost got me. Ooh. Uh, they spawn instead of the snakes that shoot bullets. And they're just terrible, man. They're so hard to deal with alongside all the other monsters. They are the number one killers 
of my runs, and I really do not appreciate them. Oh, please don't get killed by the propeller pigs. They will be so bad. <laughs> oh, no, man. It's more like I have something to prove to myself than to you. I really wanted this poisoned fish to get murdered. I don't think I have enough time to kill that. Almost sacrificed myself for 200 measly points. That would have been awful. Woohoo! Okay, okay, we gotta... We gotta cool it! Probably this... Yeah, this is m way more points. These 200s right here are far more points. Thread the needle, baby! No! <laughs> I think you can tell that it does get... Oh, I wanted that sandwich. It does get... A little hectic, a little bit more challenging to get through the piles of enemies. The bomb, the bomb did it. The bomb did it. Indirectly, or was it directly? I don't know. This guy jumps too high. He jumps too damn high. Ah, please stop being incompetent. It's so frustrating. Because I have done so much better. You just have to take my word for it, baby. Uh, my girlfriend, she just goes to a different school. There you go. She's, but she's super hot, though. You, I'll, I'll introduce you to her one day. You just gotta trust me, bro. Okay, we are completely SOL against this disgusting purple salamander floating piece of garbage. Stuff of nightmares. What a terrible, terrible entity to face. Uh, we're still pulling ahead, though. We still have five uh, lives. So you saw how terrible I've been, and I'm still ahead of the curve where number of lives is concerned. So you can do pretty badly at Ninpec and still beat it. That is the moral of this story. I'm not trying to... I'm not trying to boast. I'm not trying to brag. I'm actually just trying to show you that this game is uh, very surmountable. I really want the sandwich. I wanted the sandwich. I'm a hungry boy. This ninja needs sustenance. It is gains week. And I need to get those calories in. Those macros need to be satisfied. Not gonna happen though. We gotta have enough time for this to turn into a crown after missing that delicious sandwich. Come on, crown me, baby. Oh, ho, ho, ho. great stuff, great stuff. Watch out for the extra ones, though. Don't get greedy. I've gotten greedy in the past, it never pays off. Uh, uh, I will have like five of them chasing me, it just never works out. They either drop into the abyss or they end up catching me or I get flustered with the uh, number of enemies in, on screen. Either way, it just becomes a humiliation ritual. The likes of which I've only seen in high school when I tried to join that fraternity. They had me stand outside in the cold, naked, with I am a pretty little whore painted on my forehead. Please. Oh, give it to me. Give it to me. Oh! <laughs> everything's, everything's under control. Don't worry about it. Kill the fish. Oh, this is gonna blow up. This is gonna blow. No! <laughs> it's getting too hard. It's getting too silly. Stop being garbage at the video game. Really want. Oh, come on. At least we got that. Yeah, I want that. I want that tremendously, but I cannot afford it. Let me just come down here. All right, not all is lost. It has. It was a terrible ordeal, but uh, we got this far. So we got. We gotta go down here. Actually, a sandwich spawns if you do this. I think. Yeah. If you go in between, if you thread the needle there. Man, it's so upsetting when the poison fish comes out and uh, 
drives you into despair? Told you not timed up properly. All right, well, well, we got here with three lives. I said that I look forward to the laser pigs and I meant it. Is it gonna be good laser pig land or is it going to be a humiliation? I don't know, but actually the score is pretty great because even though the enemies have been handing my ass to me, I have been really good at picking up 500 scores, uh, sources. Kill it, kill it, kill it. It's important to kill those because they explode the bullets! And makes the, my life so much harder. I think we're safe down here. Number one thing you're supposed to keep track of here is... The, the god rays that descend upon the land. And then the spawns of the laser pigs are super important to keep track of. There you go. Very nice move right there. Feeling pretty proud of it. Careful about the god ray. It's all good. It's all good. Bad mistake. Give them any money though. Oh yeah, we got through the laser pigs. There was hardly any laser pigs. We gotta go ahead and spawn the sandwich. It's all right. We thread the needle in these. We don't. <laughs> it's absolutely humiliating. Okay, we got it. It's all good. Everything's fine. And you respect the laser pigs. The laser pigs are super fast on the draw. They are capable of the utmost humiliation if you give them even a second in front of you. So don't want to be overconfident against them. All right, we got it. We got to the... I mean, unless I kill myself against gray pigs, which would be literally a first. These scum lords have never actually touched me. <laughs> it would be so humiliating to suffer the ultimate demise against them, but it's all good. All right, made it to the end. Now we fight the final boss, which the only complication in the new final boss, he shoots five bubbles instead of three. So it's not a massive change. It can get you flustered now and then. We're safe here. So good. So good. Come on, you filthy octopus. Show up so I can murder your eyeball, give you glaucoma, obliterate your retina. There's the fire bubble. Uh, other than that, I have not noticed any difference. Like, he will spawn ee, fishes and stuff, but it's fully random, you know? Uh, the attacks that we're getting. I think they, they do increase in frequency. I'm seeing more attacks than before. This is bad. Okay, just there. Hey, we got it! And that's Nimpic. That's Nimpic! It, I am surprised that I was so bad and still got here with three lives to spare. Very nice. We get a giant pile of sandwiches. I think this is the, my top score because I was grabbing so many crowns and sandwiches. We are all the way at the top, maybe? Did Cock get all the way to the top? Hell yeah! Mmm, pump that fist, baby! Try to do better, I dare you.